Hello and welcome to um, another maths video. Um, in this video we're looking at stem and leaf diagrams. Um, the question is um, telling us that the following is the number of goals scored in the last 15 season by Barnsford Hurricanes FC. Draw an ordered stem and leaf diagram to represent this information. So we've got um, 83, uh, 90, 102 and so on. Now all that we're doing with um, stem and leaf diagrams is we're breaking down the numbers um, so generally we're breaking down the numbers into tens and units so um, what we'll do first of all is look at what numbers we've got here so we've got numbers that are in the 80s so I'm going to put an 8 there that represents my tens um, we've got numbers in the 90 uh, in the 90s sorry so we'll put a 9 there that represents the 90s um, and then we'll put we've got numbers in the 100 so we'll put a 10 there to represent 10 tens if you like um, so it tells us as well and this is quite an important thing to recognize it says that it needs to be an ordered stem and leaf diagram so uh, what that means is that um, we're going to need to put these in in order in terms of size so we'll start with the smallest one we've got 82 here um, and what I like to do as I go along is cross them out as you go. Um, this just helps you make sure that you've not um, missed any out. So 82, 83, uh, next one looks to be 88, uh, next one 89 and we've got three of those by the look of it. Um, then next one 90, uh, next one um, 94, got two of those. Um, 98, looks to be the next one. Um, 99. Um, then 101. Um, 102. 105. And 108. So all that I've done here is I've just broken these numbers down into their tens and units. Um, when we do this, we have to make sure that we have a key. Um, all that we mean by a key is just saying, well, what does the what do these numbers actually represent? So what we could say is that an eight um, followed by um, a line, so that bit here. Um, and then a number after it, say two, we'll just take the first number in a uh, stem leaf diagram that represents the number 82 um, you can choose any number for the key I just usually tend to choose the first number um, that we've got so an 8 then this line here that um, we've drawn then a 2 after that line represents the number 82 now um, in exams you generally get um, we generally get three marks for these types of questions um, the first one the first mark that we get is that it is ordered so we have to make sure that they're in the correct order um, which I think I can see that they are um, the second mark the second mark you get um, so another mark for making sure that all numbers are present um, so that's kind of why I was ticking them off as I went um, just to make sure that I didn't forget any numbers so um, the other the second mark comes for all numbers present and then the um, third mark just comes from the key so just drawing this in um, now the one that most people um, tend to lose their mark on is actually the all numbers present which kind of seems a bit crazy but um, it's just very easy to overlook um, a number that's in your list so what I like to do is um, is to just count up at the end we're told here that um, we've got information for 15 seasons so let's just check our, our stem and leaf diagram to check that we've got 15 numbers in there so if we just check this we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 um, that looks to be right the other thing that we can do to help us check whether the, uh, we've included them all is as I did just cross off the numbers as you put them into the table